Hi my love, so in this video I'm going to show you how we achieve this bronze look on my beautiful model right here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, of course, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe down below so you guys can be updated with my future videos. So the first product I'm going to be using on her is the First Sally Unicorn Essence Drops and this is just going to give the skin a really healthy and dewy look before we apply the makeup. To get that super bronze glowy skin, I'm going to be using the Vita Liberata Body Blur in the shade Latte all over her skin. Of course, I'm going to list all the products and all the brushes I use down below. And we're just going to apply this evenly onto the skin, make sure everything is blended out beautifully. It's going to give us that beautiful sheen and just that supermodel glow. So after applying the Vita Liberata Body Blur, you can actually stop right there because it gives you that natural looking finish to your skin, but we're just gonna go that extra step and contour the chest a little bit. So I'm just gonna follow her natural contours and I'm using the Smashbox Studio Skin Shaping Foundation Stick to do that. This is in the shade 3.0. So of course we have to do a little bit of highlighting. I'm going to be using the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer to do this. I'm going to be adding just a little bit of this over the collarbones and the shoulders and just really anywhere we feel like we need to add a little bit of highlight to. And then I'm blending it all out using my Tarte Kabuki brush. I'm going to be blending out the concealer using the Real Techniques Beauty Sponge just because it's damp and it's just going to blend out the product a little bit easier. Okay, seriously guys, how amazing does her skin look right now? It's just so glowy and just beautiful, and you could totally stop there, but of course, I just wanna show you guys extra steps you can do. Right now, I'm just going to apply a little bit of setting powder just to kind of make sure nothing moves around and everything is set in place. And of course, if you wanna go the extra mile, you can add a little bit of this Natasha Denona All Over Body Glow, and this is just going to give an extra glow, an extra sheen to the body. Of course, like I said, it's not necessary, but it really adds just like the perfect touch of glow to the skin. Okay, so for the last and final step, we're going to highlight the highest points of the chest. So really anywhere we applied concealer, we're gonna apply the highlight, and you can use any highlight that you like. This is the Estee Lauder Heat Wave one, I believe. So this is the final look. If you guys liked this video, please give it a big thumbs up. It helps me out so much. I hope to see you guys in my next video. Have a great rest of the week and a happy holiday, and I love you guys, and I will see you soon. Bye.